ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਮਾਤਰਾ ਮਾਸਟਰ ਮਾਤਰਾ ਮਹਾਰਤ ਕਿਤਾਬ 2A 2020 ਐਡੀਸ਼ਨ ਲੈਸਨ 5 ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਜੀ ਆਇਆ ਨੂੰ ਡੂ ਯੂ نو ਵਟ ਮਾਤਰਾ ਮਹਾਰਤ ਮੀਨਸ ਥੈਟ ਮੀਨਸ ਮਾਸਟਰੀ ਆਫ ਮਾਤਰਾ ਸੋ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਅ ਮਾਸਟਰ of um reading the matra sounds you already know uda ada right you know all of the letters you know all of their sounds and once you know the matras you will be able to read anything in punjabi right so that's the idea what is this letter do you remember this is sessa very good what is this letter chacha that's right what is this letter dadda what is this letter kakha what is this letter rara what is this letter nanna what is this letter tatta what is this letter aha what is this letter babba looks like a b right so you know all of them so make sure you do these letters every day at home okay you learn them you say their sounds and that's how you're going to master them Today's lesson is about kanna and bindi. You already learned kanna, right? Kanna makes a sound ah. Now when we want to say ah, then we add a bindi at the end, okay? And that's the kanna bindi. <coughs> and it is used with the um with the kanna and some other matras like bihari. We also use kanna uh, bindi. So you will learn that later. You cannot use kanna with uda and ada. Oh I should tell you what it looks like. It looks like the letter I, right? With a bindi up on top and reaches half the length of the letter. And you will see that here. Um, we add the kanna after um, the letter, like here. Na, na means name. J, a, ja means or, right? Now let's see the muharani. Muharani is, I think, one of the most important things you can learn. Once you know the letters and the matra and the name and sound, Well, guess what? You are reading anything you want, right? So let's say the Maharani together, okay? We will say it like this. Ade kanna bindi, aan. Sase kanna bindi, saan. Right? Go ahead. Let's do that. Ade kanna bindi, aan. Sase kanna bindi, saan. You want to say after me? Okay, I'll say a little slowly. Haahe kanna bindi, haan. kakke kanna bindi ka kakke kanna bindi kha gagge kanna bindi ga kagge kanna bindi ka nange kanna bindi na chache kanna bindi cha chache kanna bindi cha jajje kanna bindi ja you know some of these letters with the just kanna and bindi are words by themselves like ha ka ga cha ja even a and sa are words jajje kanna bindi cha nyanye kanna bindi nya you will almost never use this word this letter tanke kanna bindi ta tatte kanna bindi tha dadde kanna bindi ga tadde kanna bindi ta nane kanna bindi na tatte kanna bindi ta ta means then if then that kind of ta tatte kanna bindi tha tha means place space dadde kanna bindi da tadde kanna bindi ta nanne kanna bindi na this na pappe kanna bindi pa pappe kanna bindi pha babbe kanna bindi ba ga ba ba kar diye in in english you say cow does moo in punjabi we say ba ba pappe kanna bindi pa 
mamme kanna bindi ma ma means mummy ye ye kanna bindi ya ra re kanna bindi ra lalle kanna bindi la vavve kanna bindi va shish adade kanna bindi ada shashe kanna bindi sha zazze kanna bindi za faffe kanna bindi fa okay so make sure you learn all of these um after we finish the lesson here now here <coughs> I'm going to read with you 10 words. In this lesson we are only going to learn 10 words and you have to master them. Let's not worry about what they mean right now. You will learn what they mean. Let's learn how to write them, how to spell them. Ha ha, kanna, bindi. Ha. We did the mohorni, right? Jaja, kanna, bindi. Ja. Kakka, kanna, bindi. Ka. And you're going to copy the words here theek hai mamma kanna bindi what is it you know it ma chacha kanna bindi good cha babba kanna ba rara kanna bindi ra bara bara means what is bara you know gaga kanna bindi ga vava kanna bindi va va ga va ga ma dadda kanna bindi <coughs> da gagga kanna bindi ga da ga babba kanna bindi ba daddarara dar ba dar ba dar ba dar chacha kanna cha lalla kanna bindi la cha la cha la so these are like syllables that you have in english right so these are ha ja ka ma cha bara ga va danga bandar cha la theek hai so make sure you learn these words now these are sentences now one thing um interesting i'm going to tell you is we only have used the kanna and kanna bindi there is no other matra in this one so you should not have any problem reading these words theek hai so here ha ja ma बारह पंद्रह सतारह गाव अठारह छाल बंदर आई थिंक आई यूज डिफरेंट वर्ड्स हियर डेंट आई आई डिडेंट यूज पंद्रह एंड सतारह एंड अठारह आओ दैट्स इंटरेस्टिंग आई मेड ए मिस्टेक इन हियर गुड टू नो ओके सो दीज three words 1 2 3 are different from the previous page okay but you know how to spell them right pand we learned it in level 1 pand ra pand ra stara atara atara right so here let's read the sentences das ha jana das ha jana tell me yes or no right ha means yes ja जा अंदर आ जा बाहर जा वट डज जा मीन और आई दर खा मीन और गो आउट माँ माँ नाल पार्क जा माँ मीन्स माम गो टू द पार्क विद माम बारह बारह बंदर हन बारह देर आर ट्वेल्व मंकीस पंद्रह पंद्रह बंदर हन पंद्रह पंद्रह मीन्स फिफ्टीन सतारह सतारह गाव हन सैवनटीन सैवनटीन खाउस गाव सतारह गाव नाल पंद्रह ब 
bandar han there are 17 cows and with them are 15 15 bandar monkeys 18 18 chala mar jump 18 times chala chala namar i'm telling you to ch- do chala mar then i'm saying chala namar chala means jumps bandar bandar chala marda bandar is jumping theek hai so these are the sentences you want to read after me or you can read them yourself these are mukta words or kanna words uh, or bindi words theek hai i think you can do it yourself now next pages are really really easy so these are the same words we just learned here and now you have them in pictures now you know what they mean theek hai and then here you're going to write the missing sound so they should be ha they should be ma this is baby and this is ma bara ga ba bandar ja this santra ja angur pand ra star oh we are missing missing a line here star ra atara chala theek hai so make sure you finish this page and then copy the words here many times then for tuesday homework or this is monday homework this is tuesday's homework you have to look at the picture what is this word chala so which word is is um correct word here chala this one is missing bindi chala chala no that's not correct chala yes chala that's not correct right so No. So this one's correct. This one's correct. This one's correct. And then same thing you're gonna do here. So do this with all these words. This is going to give you practice in reading. Wednesday homework. Here are the sentences we read in the earlier pages. You're going to go ahead and copy these sentences here. Make sure you read them and then copy them in your best handwriting. Then Thursday you have these words that you learned. Some of them might be new, like akha. like mama plural of mother right jama kama right so the these ones may be a little bit different than than what you know already shant but it's okay you can read new words here too and then read these words and separate them into different groups many words will go in multiple boxes like words that end with wa wa so wa bama ama kama jama gama pama right so all of those will go here then oh this um and then oh this gama means i sing and this gama means cows yeah but they both end with the baba words that are name animals so which one of these are animals we remember bandar we remember gama right and i think that's it and then three letter words so there are three letter words 1 2 3 4 5 five of them all the words that you can't use anywhere they'll go here words that are numbers which one are numbers 12 15 uh 17 18 they'll go here and the, there are words like shant and dant right latta um you haven't used them so they will go here all of them and then on friday sunday you will do a quiz in class or your teacher might tell you to do it at home you have to read what is this this is the baby and this is the is it ja sa or ma right so you're going to circle the correct word same thing with all of them and then write your name in punjabi and that is the lesson for today i hope it wasn't too hard um it's a long lesson but i think you are fine you'll be able to finish it and you will be able to learn so much punjabi super fast and i'm very proud of you and thank you for working with me and i will see you in the next lesson until then bye guruji ka khalsa bye guruji ki fateh